Welcome to the Authentic Taste channel. In this video I'm making a lentil soup with meatballs. I hope you like it. To begin with, just roughly chop one tomato, one onion, two carrots and a garlic clove. Fry them in some olive oil until they're nicely browned. Um, because we will blend them later on so it doesn't matter how you cut your vegetables uh, this is a really good way as well if you have kids and you want to get uh, them to eat their vegetables it's a good way once your um, vegetables are slightly browned as in the video add about a cup of uh, red lentils and chicken or vegetable stock. I'm just using a vegetable cube, uh, dissolving it in some hot water and adding it to the mixture. Uh, obviously the lentils will expand so you need to add more water. Keep an eye on it. You don't want it to dry out and burn. And we will cook it until the vegetables become soft and ready to be blended. Leave it to cook on a medium heat and keep checking on it. Uh, if you add, you need to add more water, you can add more. For the uh, meatballs, add some salt, some pepper, and coriander powder. You can also add some cumin powder if you want. It's optional. Uh, then mix it well and make ball shapes and fry them until they're browned <clears throat> and set it aside and we will add it to the soup at the end this soup is really popular in the middle eastern region uh, especially in the uh, holy month of ramadan uh, you would find this in every household they make it every day um, it's really delicious really nutritious uh, you don't need to add the meatballs, uh, you can just do that on special occasions or you have special friends coming over and want to impress them, that's fine, but I most of the time make it without the meatballs. It works just fine and it's as delicious without the meatballs. Um, now when it cooks, it looks like that. Uh, your vegetables are now soft, so it's time to blend. Blend really well, so you don't have any lumps or nice smooth soup. Next I'm um, chopping some parsley and I'll add that to it and some vermicelli or sha'riya we call it in Arabic and mix well. It doesn't take long to cook. It looks a bit thick to me there so I'm adding, I will be adding some water. Now the meatballs go in some hot water and mix well make sure you taste for salt and it's all ready to serve it's really delicious give it a try guys I just love this soup it's one of the favorite soups always serve it with lemon squeeze of lemon it's tasty my son loves it children will love it I hope you enjoyed this video guys Please subscribe to my channel for more authentic tasting food from me. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time. Bye bye.